Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Hello if you're new. If you are new, be sure to click that subscribe button. It means ever so much to me and really helps to support me and my channel. It means I can continue just trying the weird and the wacky of hair care. Today, as you can probably tell by the title, I have another volumizing spray to try out. I've tried a few volumizing products in the past on my channel and I'm trying to find like the perfect one for me that does everything I want it to achieve whilst not being too weighty in my hair. And so I came across this Fudge Professionals one. So my hairdresser when I last went totally recommended finding like a volume spray or volumizer that really works for my hair because my hair sits so flat to my head as you can probably see here it just sits so so flat and so I am constantly looking for products that are going to give me volume and I've come to the conclusion that I need more help and so a pre-styling treatment that's going to really help elevate that volume I feel like it's going to be the best thing for me and my hair. So I have got specifically the Fudge Professional Push It Up Blow Dry Spray. It's a gravity defining root lift and that's ultimately where I want that volume is in my roots to give just more volume so my hair looks a little bit more balanced, doesn't sit as flat. So this is what I'm gonna be trying today. If you're curious to find out more about this product and how it works for me, be sure to keep on watching. More about the product, with a frizz control system, this spray delivers maximum volume on full blasts whilst helping to eliminate frizz and flyaways. Hydrolyzed keratin helps strengthen the hair and thermal shields protects against damage from heat styling. So ultimately this is a two in one, it has heat protection and also adds that volume. This of course is recommending to go in with a round brush, so I've got my Lux Pro Styler which has that round brush attachment, very similar to the Dyson one. And so what I understand after watching how to use this product is literally lifting your roots up, spraying it exactly where you need it to activate and to provide that root lift and then going and styling as usual. And we shall see if this has worked because like I said, finding the best volume spray is going to be a bit of a quest for me. So I'm sure there's going to be plenty more videos trying different volumizers. So if you have a recommendation, please do let me know. Oh, I love that spray. Oh, and it smells so good. Can you see how fine that spray is? Oh my God, it smells so, so good. Oh, that smells so, so good. I love the fact that this is such a fine spray. I love just the design of it. I feel like this looks very professional, which I love. Um, a lot of the fudge products I've tried previously have been really good for me. So I'm excited to try this. This also claims to have a hold factor of five, so you shouldn't have to go in with hairspray after. This should do the hybrid of everything I've listed. I'm gonna be taking my Lux Pro Styler. As mentioned, this is just so similar to the Dyson. And this is the new look version, which has basically been updated to be like so much stronger than the original one. So I have a dedicated video about this styler if you wanna find out a little bit more, because otherwise this video gets too long if I waffle on about everything. But I love it. I'll have that video linked down below if you want to find out a little bit more how it works, how all the attachments work. Because in that video, I demo every attachment. But what I'm going to do is start off by basically drying my hair. I would say about 80% with the pre-style dryer. This just eliminates all of that excess moisture. I'm then going to go in with the round brush attachment. Just saves me kind of following my hair with a round brush and trying to blow dry it. Does it all in one. Just makes life so much easier. So that's my hair rough dried. Let's go in with this round brush. You can probably see I've got some volume, but not tons. I'm just trying to enhance that using this spray and with this tool. Okay, so it's definitely worked. It's definitely given me some volume. I feel like I can get more volume with other products, 
but I think especially here at the front it's given me just a bit more bounce and I feel like it looks a bit more balanced in terms of my hair as a whole just a bit more body okay i like this i think as well because it's just a spray it's super lightweight and i honestly now can't feel anything in my hair there's no stickiness there's literally no product weight to that at all that this has added a great amount of texture without adding too much product which could sit funny on your hair for a long period of time so with that said this with the round brush i definitely need to keep practicing to use a round brush in the best way i'd love to get to a point where i can do it like my hairdresser but i'm definitely not there yet i keep practicing like how to blow dry my hair well at home but for a first attempt i feel like this has definitely given me just a bit more volume a bit more bounce without that kind of weighty product in my hair and the fact that this has got a hold in it as well it doesn't even feel like there's hairspray in there honestly this is like invisible in the hair and i've just got a little bit more volume so what i'll show you is i'll show you my hair what it looked like yesterday when it had no volume spray in it and you can see just how flat to my head my hair naturally sits because anything i do to add volume doesn't tend to last that long whereas this feels like it could because it's just dried so well so nicely and i think it looks quite natural too so it's not like over the top it's not too kind of glam or silly i think it looks really nice but in order to create volume you have to create root confusion when you're drying your hair so you might have noticed where i was kind of brushing my hair in the opposite direction it sits just to create that lift and using that with a round brush is just the best way to get that natural volume where your hair's like sitting a little bit more higher than perhaps usual and I feel like it's definitely given me a good amount of body without looking too silly on my hair because it normally does sit so flat. But I also think that I definitely need to practice kind of using that round brush and get it in a way where I feel like I could achieve more volume with my technique too. So I'm going to keep practicing that. Let me know if you have any tips or tricks and also what volumizing products do you use because... I really like the way this has made my hair look. It's given me a great lift at the front there. Let me know what you guys think. And like I said, any recommendations that you have on volumizing sprays or products, let me know because honestly, I feel like I need to find like the one for me. Even though this was nice, I don't feel like the results are as crazy as you can get with other products. But again, it's probably a lot to do with me <laughs> than it is this product. But it's great to try it as a total beginner in terms of really lifting the roots it's not something i've done too much in the past and something i definitely want to start focusing on just to get that balance in my hair especially as my hair gets longer it kind of drags my roots down and i just want a little bit of lift here just to give it a little bit of something so yeah i hope you've enjoyed the video and it's been interesting if you've had this product on your wish list let me know i'll have it linked down below if you want to check it out find out a little bit more information about the product but ultimately it was so easy to use the fact it's so lightweight i think is a huge selling point for me me and so the more i use it i'm sure the better the results i'm going to get so let me know if you want an updated video on this in a few months time when i've kind of perfected that technique or if you're just happy for me to run through it when i do an empties video either's fine um but i definitely think that yeah i feel like i could get more out of this i just need to learn how to so yeah i hope you enjoyed the video be sure to click that thumbs up button if it has been helpful and i will see you guys in my next video hopefully cheers bye